Hello. So I just want to do a real quick review on the uh, Concealment Express um, holster. Um, I had recently purchased one. Um, it was uh, um, $34. This is the product here. Um, great product. So I purchased it right on Concealment Express's website. And um, it was, uh, like I said, it was $34 for just the plain black one. I didn't do the carbon fiber. Um, you know, I mean, it, it's, it sits inside the pant line. It's an inner waistband holster. So it's not like you're going to really see it uh, besides when it's out, I guess, sitting on the table or in the safe or whatever. So I just went with the cheaper one, the thirty, you know, $34. Um, if you spend $50 on their website, you get free two-day shipping. Um, however, uh, I didn't order that. I could have paid an extra $2 on my $34 order, made it $36, and then got free two-day shipping. But I wasn't in a hurry, so I think I, I ordered it on a Thursday. And it was it shipped that day and was at my house um, on Saturday. So... That's pretty impressive. Saturday afternoon, I think I got it like 3.30 in the afternoon. So, um, yeah, I was really happy with that. Their customer service is really good. Um, I think a guy named Ben, it's probably an automated message, but uh, emailed me and just asked me how everything was, if I enjoyed it and everything like that. Um, and, uh, yeah, I would definitely recommend this holster to anyone. Um, so, like I said, I bought it for the Glock 43. Um, and uh, it, um, I really enjoy it, though. Um, so, <clears throat> setting this stuff aside here, um, when I got it, it was a little bit snug, so they do have adjustable retention, you need a Phillips, um, screw, and then you need a flathead for this side, so you can just put the flathead, and the, this side is basically like a nut, so you're just holding that nut in place, and then you just back this out, so you back it out to loosen the retention, tighten it to, um, stiffen the retention, or increase the retention. Um, and then it's also got adjustable screws, um, for your clip. So I believe they're about 15 degrees adjustable, um, where it was set when I got it is perfect for me. Um, so now, you know, the retention is pretty much just where I like it. And now you never, that's one nice thing about this too. This gun is honestly never going to come out of this holster. I mean, you can shake it, um, whatever way you want to grab it by the clip, whatever you want to do. It's not going to come out. So that's that's huge to me, you know, and to anybody who's going to conceal carry a firearm. Um, the fitting is great. So, um, Glock has the ridges, um, I guess you can see on this side, and the holster actually includes those ridges on it. Um, the sights, you can have upgraded sights, um, whatever sights pretty much you want on it, and they're not going to hit. You can see um, there's a lot of room, you know, for it to clear, um, so you never have to worry about that. Um, the magazine release is, does not touch, so you don't have to worry about that catching either. Um, it's even got the, you know, where your safety, or not your safety, but your slide lock is and everything on the side. You've got the out, you know, the, um, it's, it's there for that. Um, so then, um, also it does not leave any marks on the gun, which is important. Um, it's, you know, Kydex, so it does very well. Um, but nothing, no marks on the gun at all, so gotta be happy about that. Um, I'm trying to think of what else here. Um, and it actually, so when you put it in, you can get it in, but you know it's in when you hear the click. So it, you know, it makes a, a click sound that, uh, it's in. Another thing to point out too, the trigger guard, you're never going to get a finger in there. You're never going to get a hand in there when you don't want, you know, when it's in the holster. It's, it's the chances of this gun accidentally going off in this holster is I would say slimmed it on, um, <clears throat> which is very important also. So um, in putting it on, I always wear it at like four or five o'clock position, um, and I'm a bigger guy, so um, I always just I usually have the gun in the holster when I do put it on, um, and then obviously I always wear a belt. So I just will put it on, slide it kind of to where it feels comfortable, and tuck it in, and away you go. You know, um, I feel even though, even with a t-shirt, it wouldn't be too bad to, to hide. Um, so, you know, if I was to say I wasn't wearing a sweatshirt, it's kind of hard with wearing a sweatshirt, but I don't think it would be all that noticeable. Um, 
obviously the sweatshirt kind of throws it off, but, um, but yeah, so, come on, stays on there pretty good, which is important, um, <clears throat> so, I've had this holster for probably, I would say, three weeks or so, I carry it, you know, almost every day, all the time, um, I carry it a lot at home, because honestly, I'll go somewhere, um, sit in the, you know, sit in the car, drive somewhere, which is very comfortable sitting, and I'll get home, and I'll forget that I'm still wearing it, and literally, it'll stay on me for most of the day when I'm at home, so, which is good, I mean, comfort is huge in a, in a carry holster, um, I would recommend it, um, there's really nothing bad that I have to say about this holster, I mean, overall, the shipping was great, the timing, the time was great, um, the price was great, you know, for, for $34, you really can't go wrong for a good quality Kydex holster. So yeah, it's going to kind of give you a, a little bit of a close up. Now another thing that's important is being a bigger guy, um, I've had holsters before, plastic ones, so that this will actually rub into your side and hurt a little bit, rubbing a little bit of fat. So this doesn't do this. This all these edges are nice and smooth, um, so there's nothing wrong. You know, it won't dig in the air or anything like that. Um, I know Alien or uh, Consumer Express sells like a like a um, lubricant that you can actually use to put on the holster to help your gun slide in and out easier. But I mean, it probably works good. But literally, I mean, it's easy enough. If it's too tight for you, adjust the retention a little bit, and that will do the trick for you. So. Um, yeah, great holster. The clip is good. Um, these holsters are made in America, which is good. Um, actually, on the inside of the uh, inside of the belt clip, it actually has an American flag on it. Um, so, yeah, for the price, I would put this up against a crossbreed or an Alien Gear any day. Um, I was actually looking at purchasing both of those um, brands, and after doing a little more of my own research, um, I found that it probably really just wasn't quite worth the money. I'm sure they're great holsters, but this is a great product for a great price. So, yeah, I just figured I would do this quick review. Um, and uh, any questions, feel free to comment below, and I'll try to answer. Um, like I said, this one is for the Glock 43, and it fits great. I'm really happy with it. So, um, I have some other guns that I'll probably be purchasing the same holster for. Um, yeah, so there you go. Like I said, any questions? Uh, feel free to comment, uh, hit the like button if you like the video, hit subscribe if you like the type of video. I'm going to try and start doing some more uh, firearms reviews, holster reviews, um, talking, I don't know, we'll see, whatever I feel like doing. So, alright, thanks guys.